What is going on guys, Chalky here bringing us a brand new video and today we're going to have some CSGO gameplay in the background while I tell you guys a story. Basically I was playing with Vor here and it was a two man queue and I basically went off, basically carried Vor's ass, no just saying, no just kidding. Vor is a great player but seriously played extremely well this game. This is not me obviously, sorry for the loud noise, I don't know why, what's going on here. I don't even know how to control this shit so kid's getting constantly dinked and I don't want to hear it. Can I... Uh, yes, go prof... Oh, no, never mind. Rip. Rip. Um... So basically, once we get into the game, I'll see if I can control myself. And watch myself, because this gameplay was freaking awesome. Alright, we're back. I found out how to control myself now. Uh, this is my knife, by the way, before it got scammed by Maggio. Maggio got my knife scammed. He had it in his inventory and he got it scammed, so shout out to Mad Joe for that. Just kidding, you fucking faggot. Alright, so basically today, I'm going to be telling you guys a little story. And this story doesn't have much detail, but I thought I'd bring it to you because it's a, it's a very cool cool story. And I, I don't think I've ever seen this story told on YouTube before, so. Or told, like, this type of story told on YouTube. And this is the story of the crazy best friend. Okay? And what I mean by crazy is crazy how friends and crazy how we are still friends to this day and this started off in like 2008 maybe 2009 and uh, this was around the trick shotting days best best days on cod by the way best days were the trick shotting days um, and basically I was sleeping over my cousin Matt's house and we both trick shotted so we were both like taking turns trick shotting a search and destroy lobby by ourselves and if you guys never trick shotted before you know how hard it is to hit a shot by yourself in the SND lobby so yeah, so we were trick shotting, we were having fun, and we decided, you know what, let's try to get a six man. And if you don't know what a six man is, it's basically when you have six people and you go into a search and destroy lobby, and you, you get to last alive, and then you trick shot. So basically, it's it's pretty simple thing to understand, but so you get six people so that like a random on your team doesn't kill the last person, and you can trick shot them. So we're having a lot of fun, and we decided to message all our recent players. Uh, we, I, I forgot what the message said exactly, but it, it was it was along the lines of we're looking for a six man to trick shot. It was like like I didn't I didn't expect to get any messages back, but there was one person that messaged me back. This kid gamer tag was Okaibo, okay, and basically Okaibo we, we trick shot it for like five minutes. We couldn't get a six man, so we just hung out I guess in a, in a private match. We didn't really do much. And, uh, so we added each other. We said, alright, he's a cool kid, let me add him. I was at, I was at my cousin's house, why they also add, but I was signing on my account. So then, we weren't, we didn't really talk much, we were, we were just more like, just, you were on my friends list, I was on your friends list, we don't really talk. But, um, eventually it got to the point where we wanted a six man, so we invited him. We were, we were trickshotting on Terminal SND, I remember this, Terminal Search and Destroy, we were trickshotting on Terminal. And, like, I remember this because we had a lot, a lot of fun. I remember we were trickshotting for like five minutes, and then I, this is like the first time that I really had a conversation with, with Kaibo, or Okaibo at the time. And then, so we became pretty good friends. We were, we were talking a lot, we were, uh, we hung out a lot on, on Xbox, on Xbox Live Party Chat, best times ever. We're, and from there, he, he started up his own sniping clan called Rev. Rev Clan HQ on YouTube. If you, you've probably never seen it, but I mean, we had that was some of the literally some of my best times were in that clan, sniping alongside of the Rev Clan, and uh, so yeah, so we had a, we had a good time sniping, and basically, DJ was uh, or Kaibo, his name is DJ, and if you if you've known me. For a decent amount of time, or if you talk to me, you probably know who DJ is. Um, but basically, from there, we started up Rev Clan. We made a promo. It was my first ever time like premiering myself on YouTube. Like I was on YouTube for the first time ever with my gamer tag, and it was cool because it was like this was my start of my sniping career. Even though it wasn't really much a career, but it was the start of my sniping career, and. Me and DJ become very close friends. We got each other's number. We would text all the time. We would talk all the time. And 
so then he was he was Rev Kaibo, I remember. And then I changed my name to Rev Claw for some reason. I don't know why. And then I changed it again to Rev Psycho. So I was I was under two names in that clan. Don't know why, but basically that's how it was. And then like fast forward like Two three years, we went our we went our separate ways. We were, we were on different sniping teams. We all were trying to make it on YouTube, and but we were still we still kept like in good touch. We'd always talk in Xbox Live party chats. We'd have a lot of fun, and I don't know. It was just it was just good times, you know. It was just chill chill times with chill friends. I enjoyed it a lot. So yeah. So then uh, it winds up being. Let's see, like maybe six years, and like we're still best friends. Like I talk to him about all of my problems and everything. Like we we talk about a lot of shit together. Like not even just shit. Like like oh hi what's up? Not small talk. We talk about a lot of problems together, and it's just become such a great relationship. But if you really think about it, how crazy is it that like it's been we've been I've known him for like seven maybe eight years. And we've never met in person, but that's about to change because DJ is coming out to New York this uh, this weekend, I believe. Yeah, this weekend. So we're gonna have a lot of fun. I'm gonna try to vlog as much as possible and get some some funny videos out. Hopefully, we can do some pranks. I don't know if DJ's down. I didn't ask him, but we could probably do some prank videos. We'll have a lot, a lot of fun. But definitely some vlogs coming your way from this weekend. And uh, I don't know. I'm excited. You know, I'm gonna meet my best friend. For eight years, I've never met in person before. And by the way, I'm ninja diffusing here because I was already dominating. So, for the ninja diffuses, but like I'm, it's like imagine seeing your best friend that you've never seen before in eight years for the first time. Like we're gonna have a lot of fun. I know we've had a lot of friends with Arpo. Like we've been friends with Arpo too. So I'll probably probably hang out with him and DJ, do some vlog footage, get some prank videos done. But I mean. This has been a short video, guys. It's been eight minutes. Actually, never mind. It's not been a short video. I don't know what to put in the gameplay, like in the background for gameplay, because obviously you don't you guys don't want to watch me ninja defuse. But at the end of the gameplay, I did go 46 and 15 with nine MVPs. We won them. We won the match by one round. I believe it was 14, 15, and we won this last round 16, 14. Yeah, we clutched up. We won this game. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you guys want more stories. Also, if Put it in the description, like, or not in the description, in the comments, what you guys want to see as gameplay. I could, I could post COD gameplay, I can get on COD and post gameplay from there. I can post Rocket League gameplay, I can post any kind of gameplay, guys. Just let me know what you guys want to see as gameplay. And, uh, basically that's it. It's been your boy Chaka, and I'm out. Peace.